problems. Uh, but at the moment, the Chinese, the party state, has proven an extraordinary ability to change. I mean, I make the joke how in America you can change political parties, but you can't change the policies. In China, you cannot change the party, but you can change policies. Uh, so in the 65 or 66 mm -hmm. years, China is being run by one single party, yet the, the political changes that have taken place in China in this past 66 years uh, have been wider and broader and greater than probably any other major country in modern memory. So in that time, China ceased to be communist. Is that what you're saying? Well, China is a market economy, and it's a vibrant market economy, but it is not a capitalist country. Here's why. There's no way a group of billionaires could control the Politburo as billionaires control American policymaking. So in China, you have a vibrant market economy, but capital does not rise above political authority. Capital is not, does not have enshrined rights. In America, capital, the interest of capital and capital itself has risen above the, na the American nation. The political authority cannot check the power of capital. And that's why America is a capitalist country, but China is not.